This 12-year-old miniature schnauzer keeps coughing and is not eating. These are symptoms of heart disease. How can we test if this dog has heart disease? This is a Be Kind to Pets veterinary educational video sponsored by Topayo Vets. Vertebral Heart Score Vertebral Heart Score, or VHS, is a measure of the size of the heart using the length of the vertebrae as a unit of measurement. VHS can be used for the diagnosis of heart disease. VHS can determine if there is any enlargement of the heart compared to normal heart sizes. Enlargement of the heart points to heart disease. When the patient shows symptoms of heart disease, the vet can calculate the VHS from the X-ray of the patient. First, take a lateral thoracic X-ray film. This is the X-ray of the miniature schnauzer. On the X-ray, use a ruler or a caliper to measure the long axis of the heart, which is the length between the carina and the apex. Next, measure the short axis of the heart, which is the length of the widest part of the heart and is perpendicular to the long axis. Transfer these two measurements to the vertebrae and place them starting from the 4th thoracic vertebra, T4. Count the number of vertebrae that fall within the measurement lengths for each of the measurements. The short axis has 5 vertebral lengths. The long axis has 5.9 vertebral lengths. The VHS is the sum of the number of vertebral lengths occupied by both the long axis and the short axis. The VHS for this miniature schnauzer is 5 plus 5.9, which is 10.9. There are calculated values of normal VHS ranges for each different dog breed. The vet can calculate the VHS and compare the values to the pre-calculated VHS ranges to determine if the dog has an enlarged heart. The normal range for miniature schnauzers is 8.7 to 11. Hence, this miniature schnauzer has a normal heart size and is not likely to have heart disease. In conclusion, VHS is a useful measurement technique to diagnose heart disease based on the heart size of the patient. It does not require many tools and it is not time-consuming. Hence, it can be done conveniently and easily in the veterinary practice.